Okay, now the next story is why I wouldn't take responsibility and intrude on someone else's family. They don't seem to understand. Again, those of you who are West Indian Americans, you guys get it immediately. And I know this because I've been around so many West Indian Americans who get this, including my own relatives who are West Indian American. They seem to forget that someone very close to me, most of the people very close to me, are, some of them are related to people who who came to this country, meaning they would have been the first on one part of their family to be born in America. So that's how they're not understanding this whole relationship with me and my West Indian background. So if you are the first to be born in this country, and that means your parents come from another country, you understand what it means to be a first generation. And if you understand it, and I'm around you from the time I was born, I get to get that feeling. I understand that. The other big deal about this is that we don't, in my family, intrude on other people's families. They don't understand that. They're still not understanding that. That's why they will never get any respect from anyone in my family and never have. They will never get that. If I am not blood related to someone, even if I were, I would not intrude on someone else's family. The other big point about this is that if you are not close blood to someone, you cannot intrude on that person's immediate family. You are not connected to that person. I've never had this argument with regular people. We're talking about common sense. You cannot intrude on someone who you are not close blood related to. And when we say close blood, everyone knows what that means. You have to be mother, father, sister, brother, child, which means you're still close blood. Close blood relatives understand each other. It doesn't matter. I don't care how these people try to twist it. You must be close blood relatives to people in order to be considered their immediate family. They're not going to call people who you are not close blood relatives your immediate family. That's one big thing. The second big thing about that is I am a 50-year-old woman. Anybody who knows me knows I've had 50 years on this earth. It wasn't like I was spending 50 years in some cave. I've been around for 50 years. You're not going to fool me with your bullshit. Thank you for watching.